Hello, this is Ronnie. Before going through with the charts, I want just to mention that I'll be um, detailing uh, concerning um, the offer that I put forward um, about my services uh, at the end of this clip. So if you're interested, uh, please stay on. After the clip, I'll be talking to you again. Other than that, I wish you have pleasant viewing and have good trading in the coming week. All the best. Okay, this is uh, silver, the weekly scale of silver price in US dollars, and we are facing a really critical crossroad uh, ahead of us, right in front, and we could be now uh, seeing silver recovering and running on the weekly scale uh, to the towards the previous high, 21, and maybe even exceeding that. Uh, in the process, registering A, B, C complete, that will terminate the B that you see here, uh, the big B in black, and that would pave the way later on for a very big break C. But right now, uh, as you can see, silver is really struggling. We're trying to regain the long-term support of this black line, the upsloping uh, line that you see here. It failed, it came down, but if we see a recovery uh, in the next, uh, I would say a week or two, and we see it climbing up, we see the major forex paths that I have um, studied in correlation, yeah, the correlation that they have with the precious metals. If we see them breaking through major um, critical levels, as I've indicated earlier uh, in this video, then I think we can feel confident that uh, silver is heading higher and it's going to deliver on the weekly scale the structure that I'm showing you here. One, two, three, four, five, and that's going to last uh, quite a while. It's going basically to relate to what you see here. This is perfectly possible because silver didn't break the low, didn't break the low. It is uh, showing serious damage after this first uh, rally of five legs. It's showing serious damage, but uh, it's still holding. And uh, it looks like uh, we could be facing now uh, a reversal and it could become very apparent very quickly. What I'm talking about is this, that's the daily. Do you see this? It's enough that we get something like that carrying it above 15.4 uh, and uh, I think we can start preparing uh, for the higher registered here to be tested and it's going to run, it's going to soar. Um, I'm going to go to the 60 minutes before doing so uh, silver going up, of course, will build on this being one, two, three, four, five first leg. And the coming down will be taken as a combination of ABC, X, ABC, essentially complex correction. Let me show you here still on the daily. Okay, we have an A, B, do you see A, B, C. And then you have a triangle A, B, C, D, E, which will be an X. And then you come down, you have five legs. That's an A, that's a B, and that's a C. So I repeat, uh, you will be coming down in an A, B, C, X, A, B, C. And the surge up may have started the turnaround. Yeah, may have started the turnaround. We cannot be 100% certain, but uh, as I told you, if it is the genuine turnaround, uh, it's not going to take a long time and doesn't require you jump for us to be uh, reasonably confident that we are dealing with a genuine bull. All we need is this. In my opinion, we need to see it running about 15.4 and settling here. Ideally, we would love to see five waves going up. Okay, and then tiny sideways lateral movement preparing essentially for an attack on the previous sign. That's going to be three or three. Uh, it's going to be quick. It's going to be fairly quick. It's going to be something like that. Yeah, and inevitably that's going to uh, coincide, as you can imagine, with a break in the dollar index, a break in the US dollar Swiss, a break uh, in the US dollar Japanese yen, yes, uh, a break in the US dollar uh, Canadian dollar. You, you have a whole list of things that I have worked on and I explained to you, uh, so um, you should pay attention to all these uh, Forex pairs because they give you the background. They give you the context and day by day, they deliver the insights to help us uh, to see the way forward. 
Um, okay, so let's have a look at the 60 minutes and look at this surge. Looks like a clean third wave. Okay, so I don't think it's finished. In fact, I think that could be a tiny uh, fourth wave. We might have seen actually a one, two, one, two. Okay, one, two, one, two. Maybe another tiny one, two, three, four, three, four, three, four. Okay, and then we finish the first leg. And then sideways price action and up we go again. Inevitably, we sink back. It does whatever it wants to do. But if two days later it comes back there, oh no, the bear is fully in command. Yes, that will be very bearish. Okay, so this is the other side of the coin. And that's why... That is the four hour scale and that's why you see the number one here because that is going to pull the entire price action right from the top into a pattern as follows. That will be a one, two, three, four, five. That will be an A. That will be an A, B, C. B, stay with me. That's an A. That's a B. Five wave run. Not making it substantially above 15.4 just a spike and a sink down there that'll that'll uh, register the second wave okay the second wave uh in silver and it's going to go down in the third wave so instead of looking up nicely silver will go into a big doom and gloom uh and you really have to be on your guard if you see something like that yeah that's you a that's you b that's you see silver not making it um uh, what I mean making it is not going to establish a, a firm base here. Certainly not run much higher. Yeah? He's not going to be able to do that. Uh, it's going to just give you a spike and a reverse. Then be on your guard. This is going to, uh, it's going to break through uh, the floor. And that's going to be mega bearish. Okay, so that's why I said we are in front of a major crossroad right now. I suspect that the chances of silver going up are not bad at all. Yeah. I think the chances are looking quite good. And um, I think that by looking very carefully at the, for the various forex pairs that I mentioned and checking the wave count there and checking the critical levels there, uh, you would get a lot, a lot of help um, looking forward here. Let's have a look at gold uh, in US dollars. Now, the main questions... The question that we have now um, in front of us, do we have the E leg behind us? That will really set the stage for a rally C. Um, the rally that I've been talking about for quite some time. If you remember, that was our A, uh, that was our B. Yeah, I mean, that will be, sorry, that will be our B uh, if we have really indeed the E leg behind us. And then we will run through the previous high uh, and we will see spectacular shot in gold uh, delivering the ABC that will terminate the B. After which, of course, we could see a, a pretty serious uh, decline. But let's deal with things one step at a time. This is the weekly. And let's just look at the time scale. It, it, does it make sense? Does it make sense to us? Uh, does it make sense to actually consider this is the end of the E-leg? Is it possible? I don't really see a problem. Uh, yes, it is brief. It is brief. It's not uh, on a scale of what we have seen before. Yeah, this is a big leg. This is a very big leg. Yeah, this was even bigger in terms of uh, the time. It took uh, longer. Yeah, but I don't see really an issue. That could definitely be the end of the e-leg. And um, if it is indeed the end of the e-leg, then of course we will start climbing gradually. Um, to higher grounds and that is the uh, daily scale so the e leg might have taken the shape of an ABCD as you can see here and there is definitely a case for arguing uh, that we have here triangle um, behind us look at this ABC ABCDE all of this is composed of uh, uh, bits and pieces if you like of ABCs so ABC gives you an A ABCDE gives you a B Coming down, A, B, C gives you a C. That is an A, B, C. Gives you a D and that is an A, B, C. Gives you an E. What's the problem? Yeah, A, B, C, D, E. Fine. So if that is the case, the first thing that should happen, of course, uh, gold is going to have to show that it has what it takes 
to start climbing. First target above 1290. Sit above that level, go sideways. That will be targeting 1310. I think by the time it uh, uh, jumps above 1310, I think we have we have something in hand. Yeah, I would I would imagine by the time it does that, uh, we will probably be witnessing some serious uh, breakdowns through critical levels in the various forex pairs that I mentioned. And it is your job if you want to be on top of the price action. Just follow all those forex pairs one by one. Line them, um, line them uh, if you can horizontally, so you can even see on the same screen if you are able to do that. And then you will have the entire context in which gold is moving, gold and silver. It's not something that I invented yesterday. It's something that has been going on for decades uh, and it's likely to continue to go on. It is in the nature of the market to operate like that because everything, everything is connected. Yes, nothing is trading uh, on its own, uh, on an island. You know, everything is connected. Everything is being influenced by everything else. This is now the 60 minutes of gold and that could prove to be a 1-2. If that's a 3, we're going to have a fourth wave and of course it will continue to look up. It has no business coming there. Okay, uh, breaking under 1,273 short term on the hourly. That tells you there is something else going on. My consideration that we may have struck the end of the E leg right here is probably wrong. We would have to modify that. Uh, so that is the first sign that we have to take a uh, step back and review the, the wave count. Uh, however, if it continues like that, it runs back to challenge, to challenge this level 1288, 1289. Uh, we are in the game. We are in the game of a possible evolving bull here uh, in gold. Hello. I'm back here, Ronnie, with uh, some details about my service. If you're interested, then uh, please get onto my website at www.wavemastery.com. That uh, brings you here to the homepage. And um, there is quite a bit of information here. For example, what this website is about. So uh, you got several articles here that you can uh, read and you will have, uh, if you like, um, an idea, I present the way I look at things and how I approach the analysis, etc. Subscribe here. Um, concerning the, the offer, you would want to look at this. Uh, at this page, daily service uh, special offer or weekend service special offer. Um, this is available only to people who have not uh, tried the service before. Yes, because it is 50% off for the first year. Uh, this is um, for people who have already tested uh, or if you like uh, have been with my service and then took a break, came back, etc. Um, use subscription here would uh, put you on the, uh, direct you to the right service once you log in, whether you subscribe to the daily service or the weekend service. Uh, resources, uh, there are lots and lots of charts here and their galleries. Um, if you're interested to see how I go about, uh, um, you can you can really run through that. Lots of charts here. Um, you can see they date from various periods in the past here, and they're all annotated. I've annotated all of them. You can actually um, access each one of them and uh, have a good look at. Uh, you need to get. Uh, you see the hand right here. You need to get it to show that. And then uh, you click on it and then it opens the big page. You can um, analyze that. You can um, uh, print it if you like. Yeah, you can get big uh, uh, version as well. Uh, in short, uh, that would give you a very good idea how I go about analyzing many different markets. Here you got uh, copper from 1973, platinum. You got uh, gold, heating oil, light crude. There are really lots of different market uh, serbines, the grains here, uh, corn. Uh, when you go back, uh, that was just gallery number one. Then you have number two, number three. In short, could be quite fun for people who really like uh, working with charts. 
useful links very uh, standard I've just got a link here to the data feed that I'm using eSignal next you can check uh, recommended training list yes under this tab it uh, details here several books that I've come across I read I enjoyed reading them I learned from them quite a bit um, I read many many more books uh, over the years but th these are some of the books I don't always have time to uh, put in uh, to update my list but um, already here you will find quite uh, quite interesting uh, things um, next private policy very standard stuff okay very standard stuff uh, you can run through that if that's of interest to you terms of use also very standard stuff I don't collect your data I don't mess up with your data I don't sell your data I do nothing with your data quite frankly and uh, here contact us if you have any question uh, don't hesitate uh, make sure you give me the right uh, email address so I know I know I can get back to you uh, don't forget to fill in this uh, press submit with your question whatever and I get back to you no issue uh, login that's once you are subscriber of course you use that now I want to go back to the home page run down a bit I have uh, I have uh, written here a few things that you might like to take a look at um, is access to my YouTube channel there is uh, a few a few things that I collected people's uh, what people said about my service and I um, I guess over the years I have received many more it's just a, a question that I didn't sort of uh, pay attention to collect everything here and that's where I want to attract your attention to uh, that is the trial for the daily videos which is 9.99 after one week you like what you see you don't do anything you just continue it uh, the program will take you on to the daily videos uh, at 79 per month uh, and it gives you a video every day except Sundays lengthy comprehensive Saturday video like the one I have recorded today access to archive videos uh, request specific information regarding a market yes I will relate to your question no 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 problem and then you press on subscribe here if that is your choice um, trial for weekend videos yes two week trial that gives you long comprehensive Saturday video access to archive videos occasional midweek bonus video yes I do often uh, insert as a bonus a midweek video just to keep you on track yes because sometimes after two days the market especially if you are focused on uh, short-term trading after two days two three days the market really can take completely different direction lots of options can open up in just two days um, okay so as you can see it's special promotion offer 50% uh, off normal price open only to first-time subscribers and uh, let's suppose you choose this one there is no VAT to pay even if you are from Europe uh, there is now a new regime so no VAT whether you are from Europe or whether you are from the States Australia no matter where you are that's the price there is no any addition to that what you see here suppose you come here to um, in daily service subscribe here special offer uh, you need to read that okay and you like what you see you click here it takes you to PayPal um, that's where I chose you the um, you have to fill in this you um, you go through the process you pay it, it it takes you back it takes you back to my website okay that's my official name so don't be uh, surprised it's not under wave mastery it's just uh, uh, my name okay so it takes you back after you pay it takes you back to the website to fill in your uh, profile uh, yes select your login and uh, essentially uh, gives you it gives you access uh, remember when you come to the page and if you don't see anything you have to click on use subscription you will see if you subscribe to daily service video you just click on that you will see the link to the most recent video if you subscribe to the weekend service you do the same you get uh, the link to the freshest updated uh, video so that's essentially it uh, please don't hesitate if you any you have any questions uh, I'll be glad to to answer your questions to help you um, you can find me through here or through here okay um, I would love to hear from you would love to see you visiting my website wish you the best of luck for the coming week uh, great trading and um, hope to see you soon bye now